I'm right. I'm gonna start cooking up. Let's go. <clears throat> Twitch.tv slash Elwins Beats One. Let's go. We're cooking up. Let's go. Check Twitch all the time. All good. I'm feeling to use some rim shots for the little uh, for the main drill part. I need some perks. Crazy kit, by the way, guys. This uh, Saint Six. Let me use one of these ones, actually. Okay, so we're gonna go for the typical drill bounce. Usually, I kind of, or I mean, the main thing to do is we add the first step here. Uh, hold on, let me just get this in the mixer. Turn the sample down. Maybe it's a little too loud. Uh, limiter, soft bar. Cool. Okay, so usually that's how I'd start off my drill beats, that typical uh, drill pattern, but I'm gonna take out the first step to give it more of a... It gives it a, a kind of room to breathe almost, right? session with the snare right now too the dior snare it's just too crazy just uh you know what i'm gonna do actually guys to make this quick <clears throat> and a good way to demonstrate my new kit so i created a uh drill midi kit the peridium my dragon a snare pattern i'm gonna drag in a random one let's call it uh we're gonna go for the slippery snare pattern Although I do need to add it to another pattern as it is longer than the hat pattern we got there. Here we go. Woo. What we might do is actually add some six step delay Apologies if all you can hear is an airplane outside. I've actually got my window open in the studio because it's pretty hot in here right now. Everyone on uh, Instagram, twitch.tv slash beats one so you can hear exactly what I'm cooking up on my headphones right now. Everyone on Twitch is on the, I don't even know I'm chatting. Beats my OP, what's good bro? Is the loop reversed or did you do it? Uh, no, it's reversed on its own like that. I'm gonna add some crazy kick drum right now. I'm pretty sure it's in this one. Number two. So it's slapping a simple, simple kick drum. Instagram, twitch.tv slash elbowspeech1. Let's go. We're cooking up right now. We are cooking up. Live. Where'd you get such hard hitting kicks in 808s? Bro, like I just build up a collection of freaking. Uh... Okay, we got 21 people in the chat right now. Amazing. I appreciate you guys. Keep going, keep going. I just get a load of random kits from people, um, just shit I find on the internet, and I do buy a lot of my stuff as well. 
I buy quite a lot of my loop kits unless I find free ones on YouTube then I do prefer to buy them because when you buy them you just get more you get the stems you get the full packs nowadays if people got like free kits and they just you get you're not getting the stems you're not getting the whole thing so it's nice to support other producers as well as it's crazy when I get a loop kit sale myself so it's nice to give back all right we're about to add some uh, hi-hats some little fills that's quite a nice one needs to be a little roll up here it's the only thing I hate about FL20 it makes it, I have to kind of like resize it so it's, it looks like it's actually on the bar it's really weird Turn it up a little bit. Uh, let's normalize it. I need the little. Probably sound like an absolute idiot right now. some six step delay as well to that because it's sounding a little dry it's always good to add some delay to your hats and even the little filler ones because it just gives it more kind of rhythm and bounce so now if i play this with a six step delay halfway cut ping pong pan it to the left or right doesn't matter turn the actual volume of the plugin down you see so now i'll play it with the actual Real Aiden, yo, what's good? Do you make a living off just selling beats or do you also have another job? Uh, no, so I quit my job about seven or eight years ago. I used to work in a place called Maplin um, and I worked there for three and a half years as an electronic specialist. Um, and then, yeah, I'd just be making a beat, uh, making a beat, <laughs> making a living off selling beats, kits, loops. Um, you know, I've built up my own Spotify now, um, which I'm pretty happy with. If you guys can see this is crazy i'm currently at 67,000 monthly listeners and the last 28 days i've had 234,900 streams on my spotify alone which to me is mind-blowing like as a producer like i think that's crazy that you know we can kind of achieve those streams just off of just website um just off yeah just off street have you ever had a dreams that that you um you had you 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 could you do you you want yeah let's get some uh okay let's get a little crash in here let's go for the typical drill crash maybe let's pitch the sample down let's see what it sounds like with that maybe let's go up What I am going to add is a lovely little roll. Um, oh, I love this one. It's dark as hell. So we've got to find a particular place to put it. Let's see. 
Ooh, okay, let's take that loop off. Oof. Fire. Let me find another little. That's kind of. It's kind of dope. Maybe pitch it up a little. Nah, let's replace it with this one, maybe. Let's see what this one sounds like. Maybe this is like a... Okay, we'll have that one right at the end to fill that gap right here. Whoosh. Let's add some open hi hats in here right now. I need a. Maybe. Put the second hat there actually. I kind of love uh, open hats because you can kind of put them sporadically in these different places and it just creates such a different bounce. Like if I move it from here to here, right? So this is when it's here. Or if I put it just before. Jeez. get is a here we go and I like to put this every kind of give it more of a different bounce right so if you add these in just every kind of gives it more drive it leads it a little bit more maybe put that on like the second half of the verse um, or something like that don't have it going all the way through because it can sound too repetitive but it works Maybe change the sound on it later, but we'll see. Let's go, B minor. We're just gonna add some uh, kind of gospel-ish vocals. So I'm gonna go to Distant Voices for this pack. Simple and it works. Crazy. All right, so I need to cut out the lows of this beat real quick. Uh, I need to cut out the lows of the sample, sorry. Because we need to add in some crazy, crazy 808. I think I might keep it simple with the 808 though. I don't want to go. Uh... I'm going to take out some low frequencies here. Just so there's more room for the 808 to come through. So we are still in B minor with the 808. Always gotta check, make sure you're in key. Cause there's nothing worse than an 808 out of 808. An out of key 808. Maybe that's too low. do it. 
Wah, 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 wah. Typical drill slides right here. Uh, if I just adjust that properly though, because it's kind of leaking over to the next note. <sighs> okay. Da, 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 da. <laughs> So we're looking at F sharp. with the mouse clips bro One more 808, which will be a grimy 808. Um, and I'm gonna This one's just like a madness. Put it up, save it. <laughs> 